The Bible says in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 28, verses number 18 through 20, And Jesus came and spake unto them, saying, All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you, and lo, I am with you alway, even unto the end of the world. Amen. Here we have the Great Commission. But as the Lord gives the Great Commission to his disciples, at the same time, he manifests to them two of the Lord's attributes, two of the Lord's divine attributes that reveal to us the deity of Jesus Christ. Those are, those are his attributes of omnipotence and omnipresence. When he said, all power is given unto me in heaven and in earth, that's speaking to the Lord's omnipotence, the fact that he is all powerful. That's why we worship him as God. God manifested in the flesh. He's omnipotent. He's all powerful. Only God possesses that divine attribute. And then we also see the divine attribute of his omnipresence when the Lord told his disciples, lo, I am with you always, even unto the end of the world. What was the Lord doing when he manifested or when he uh, presented to them? When he talked about his two, two of his uh, major divine attributes as God, the Lord was encouraging them because as he had explained to his disciples before, his disciples, as they go out to fulfill the Great Commission, they were going to suffer many great things. They were going to suffer much persecution. They were going to go through many trials and tribulations. But the Lord is trying his best to encourage them. And you know what? As we likewise go forth and do our, to do our best to fulfill the Great Commission in our day and time, we as well are going to go, we are also going to go through trials, tribulations, and many setbacks and challenges. But we need to be reminded of what the Lord reminded his disciples. We also are his disciples and we need to keep in our minds the omnipotence and omnipresence of the Lord. No matter what we go through, never forget the Lord is all powerful. He is able. He is able to do exceeding abundantly above all that we ask or think because he's more powerful than we even realize. And not only that, we need to remember no matter what we go through, that the Lord has given us this precious promise to be with us every step of the way. God bless you.